Have you ever tried invisible writing? There are many different methods you can use. One of the oldest is using lemon juice. Here's what you do. You start by cutting a lemon in halves, then you squeeze the juice of the lemon into a glass, and you use that as if it were ink or paint. I've already started. You can see I have quite a good supply of lemon juice. I'll dip my brush into it, and then proceed to write a secret message on this piece of paper. Now, if you're looking carefully, you may be able to see the letters that I'm writing because the paper's wet, and you may be able to work out from that what the message is going to be. But, you see, you let that dry, then you put it in an envelope and send it to your friend through the mail. If anybody else opens the letter, they don't read a thing. But your friend knows how to decode that message. Blank paper. What do you use? An iron. You may need some help with this. You need a fairly hot iron, and you simply iron the piece of paper carefully, slowly but surely, and what happens is, as if by magic, some letters start to appear. Now, you probably guessed that I was writing my name anyway. Dean, there it is, D-E-A-N-E. -E. I keep moving the iron around, and as I do so, the letters become clearer and clearer. Now, you can see what happens is that the letters, where the lemon juice originally soaked into the paper, have gone brown. Why is this? Well, it's because the lemon juice has sugar in it, and it's a bit like burning sugar or making toffee. You've actually formed toffee in the paper. You can use anything that has sugar in it. You could use orange juice, but you wouldn't because the orange colour may stain the paper. You can use practically any soft drink, but if you're going to, don't use a cola or anything like that. Use a clear drink, such as lemonade. And when you do that, once again, you can draw a picture or you can write a message and you'll be able to bring it up by using the iron. See if you can work out what's coming up here. Now the letters should be a little clearer this time because I took a little more care when writing the message and also I let the letters dry out properly before starting to iron them. Uh -huh. And if I lift up the iron, I think you'll be able to see that we have two words and they're words that should be familiar to you Curiosity Show. Okay, now if you've never tried invisible writing, get yourself a lemon or some lemonade and try it with your friends.